What is up, Queen Mafia fan? I'm back with another video. So, sorry about the background because I'm on the floor. Because I'm still working. Um, I'm going to give my shouts to Free Man. What I have on my face is a peel off mask. And it's a lemon clay peel off clay mask. And it's um, sweet tea and lemon from Dollar General. Before I put that on, I washed my face with this proactive deep cleansing face wash. And you can shop this on my website. I put it on my eyebrows and my eyelashes. And then we got some lip gloss, some brown lip gloss from my website. So go shop. Right now, I got a bacon and egg. I was going to say bacon, egg, and cheese. I got a bacon and egg sandwich and some, what would you call it, unsweetened tea with no sugar because I'm doing my dieting so from red diamond all natural tea so this is the first time I drink it like this well not really but yeah so I'm gonna be talking about like how I feel living alone and eating so I moved. Um, I moved, and you know when people move at young ages, it can be really hard. And people think, "Well, oh, I can't wait to move out my mom's house," but you honestly don't know the consequences of being an adult. I promise you. First thing. When I got here, I stressed. I really stressed really bad. About bills. And like, oh, I'm gonna pay this bill and I'm gonna pay that bill. Yeah. Oh my God. All right, love you too. You leaving? So like I said, um, don't rush to leave your mom's house. I didn't. I waited a while, like, cause I'm 19 now, so. I did wait a while to move out. This is irritating me, so I'm taking it out. But yeah, I did wait a while to move out of my mom's house. I'm 19 now. So, I decided before I was 18 to move out. Because I always told my sisters, oh, I'm going to move out when I'm 18. I'm going to move out. So, it took a progress, you know, to find the perfect house for me. And um, it didn't take that long, but it took a while. Um... When you move in and you want to, um, my suggestions, what I had, I haven't even been here a month yet. I haven't been in my house a month yet. Um, you got to find the budget range. I said the budget range. The budget, your budget range of, um, how much you want to pay. How much you want to pay um, and make sure that you're getting that every month or year depends how much you know like um, how much you pay I mean how much you get from your job so make sure you get okay say you work at McDonald's and you only get 300 a week then you need to find a room Cause I don't think the house gonna be no three hundred. So a room that's gonna be less than three hundred. Cause you you gonna need food. You gonna need stuff to clean your house. Um, you gonna just need different stuff for your house. You gonna need new stuff. That's how you're supposed to save before you move out. You don't just wake up one morning and say, "Oh, I'm moving," and don't have no money saved up. Cause you gonna need money saved up like me. I saved my money up and. Um, got some stuff, ordered stuff for my house. I got my bathroom almost complete. My kitchen is almost complete. Like, you know, stuff like that. Couch and TV and my TV stand. Most of my stuff is almost complete. But you should always want to save your money before you think about even moving out. Like, that's what I did. I saved my money. Because you're going to need it for furniture, like I said. You're going to need it for food. 
you're gonna need it for things in your house because no more mom no more dad i mean they'll still help you out of course because my mom still help me i still go to her house to get food and stuff even though i got food in my refrigerator i still go over there and get food like a plate if she cook or something but yeah you um when you moving out it's your responsibility like to pay your bills so make sure you don't miss no work make sure you got everything together with your life don't just think because you grown you want to move out if you're 25 and still live with your mom it's okay it is okay just start preparing to move out at least start writing stuff down like you know make a this probably would make no sense to y'all but like me i said i was gonna move out at 18 but moved out at 19 because it took a while don't don't be like look now look for your place now like look where you want to live at see if you like it because if you do last minute things you're not going to be happy with your decision so look now for places cheap places you don't when you get your first apartment you don't gotta go all big just because drake got a his first house was so beautiful and all that or whoever like you know you know what i'm saying right like you know you don't gotta go all big you know just to show people all you need is just you know your first house should be simple to me unless you got it all but me nope i'm going simple with my house i got enough space got my room got my beauty room that's all i ever wanted like i told myself when i get a house i want enough rooms to get a beauty room and honestly, I'm working on my beauty room. My beauty room gonna be dope when y'all see it. Oh my God, I cannot wait to show y'all. And like, I moved without no roommates. I said roommates. Roommates, like nobody else is here but me and my son. And I have no roommates. Like, I didn't have to get a co-sign. I did this all myself. I filled every piece of paper out by myself. Like, I'm glad I don't have to have a roommate to pay my bills. I can pay my own bills. Like, my um, entrepreneur life been doing really good. Like, it don't pay all my bills because I don't get as many work. But, um, yeah. You don't want to rush. That's what I'm saying. But moving on is exciting. Like, I, you're going to have stress. You're going to stress because I did. I haven't even been in my house a month yet and I was stressed so bad about everything. I even cried, like honestly. Like I moved all my stuff in and then I was like, dang, what's next? What to do? Like I did not know what to do next. But now it's just like, you know, you gotta do what you gotta do because you got bills now. You got a son to raise. Um, you can't stress because then you'll stress your son out because I was crying and then he started crying. I'm like, oh, I gotta be a, good, a big girl. <laughs> so, yeah. Um, make sure you know what you want to do when you move. Don't just rush out. I've been in rush out. I've been had this plan for years and years. And I was told my sisters and brothers, sisters and brothers, and they ain't never listened to me. So, oh well, I moved out now out of my mama's house. I don't know if she's happy or not, but this stuff is so hard to take off if you don't put two wigs. Like, literally. But yeah, moving out. This topic was supposed to be how I feel about moving out, but I was going everywhere. I feel amazing. I feel grown. This is the grown lady way, the grown lady everything. Like, this what you call a grown woman like moving out you know and doing what you got to do for your family oh guys what is up queen mafia family and i'm back with another short video so i'm just here to say when y'all watch a video make sure y'all like comment and subscribe and make sure to follow my instagram at the bdig and my snapchat at queen tay 124 and if you have any question business questions Email me at dshante64. I love y'all and I hope, I 
hope y'all had or have a good day. Bye.